Hi everyone, it's Earrings by Angela and this is Angela speaking to and with you. You guys, welcome to our Zen Thing series. I am loving this. I am so loving this. So today we're going to talk about letting out a big sigh. You guys, that was, what I just did was just so powerful. That was the first step in letting go and just getting your zen back in real life with James Harley. <laughs> I love saying that, y'all. I've been saying this since I was little. But it, it, it's true. It's true because it's like a sigh of release, right? You're releasing a negative thought, a negative feeling. You're getting your wusta back, right? So I remember one time when I was working this job, um, we used to have Wednesday meetings. <laughs> and I was I would say, I'm just gonna keep it real. I felt like we weren't meeting anything about anything except what was wrong with us. Right. So I used to be like, oh my gosh, I cannot sit here and keep my this is so toxic. And I'd be like, <sighs> like that, right? But every time something negative was said, I'd be like, because <sighs> <laughs> I didn't want to receive it. So I remember one of, I was at my desk and I was filing papers because we, we, we were keeping files and the feds were coming. So we had to make sure all of that was in order. And one of, the higher-ups, not that high, y'all, though. Come on, keep it real. But one of the higher-ups walked past my desk, and I must have been frustrated about something that was in the file, like, oh, my gosh. And I said, <sighs> and because I knew I made a mistake, and I was like, now nah, I got to do the whole thing over. Frustrated, right? And she came, she backed up and walked, walked leaned against my desk, and she's like, stop doing that. And I was like, excuse me. She said that. <sighs> and I was like, okay, yeah. But she said, stop doing that. And I was like, mm, no. <laughs> I was sad for y'all. But um, because I said, that's my form of release. If I'm frustrated, that's the only way, the only positive way that I can let go of release. So I'm good, you know. And then she got upset and walked away. And I'm like, well, it's not about you, <laughs> you know, and your breath is about you, whatever you need to do to get your Zen back. This is one of the tools that I use. I let out a big sigh. Now it can be for frustration or it could be for relaxation because on the flip side, have you ever had that massage or laid up under the most comfortable blanket ever and you're like oh. right i who who has done one of the, one of those sides right that is like saying thank you this is heavenly you know the massage you like ooh, 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 and you try not to be all verbal so you right? Letting out that breath. But breathing deeply is, is amazing. And, you know, even Sesame Street taught us to count, you know, to calm down. Daniel Tiger says it too, you know. So it, it's, it's a very high relaxation technique. And sometimes even when you're in yoga and you're trying to control your breath and you you control your breath because your breath controls the rest of you. That's how I feel, right? So they say, count up to four, count down to four, you know, four breaths in, four breaths out, four breaths in. 
four breaths out. In just that moment, you're more relaxed than you were before. Do you notice how when I just did that exercise, I was hyper before, but now I calm down. Let your breath keep you in the flow. That's how you find your zen. That's how you get your calm back. That's how you create balance. That's how you have more harmony in your life. It is your breath. That is breath. You guys, it's a zen thing. And I think you understand it. With that, I will leave you. Let's do one more. We'll do four breaths in. Four breaths. Thank you for joining me today. Become part of the EBA family by hitting the subscribe button. Share this video with your friends and family. If you did the breath with me, let me know by liking this video. Comment some of your techniques that you use for breath work or how often do you need to let out a big sigh? Peace and blessings to you all.